What's going on you guys? I have another HP Pro Desk. This is the small form factor, gonna be a teardown. So let me get the screwdrivers. So this is what I, what you, I need. So I got a, this is the Torch T15 Phillips head, flat head you need. And I got this uh, smaller one, Phillips head, this one right here. This is for the removing the up. This is for the integrated speaker you have to remove. There's a thumb screw here on the left side. This is what it looks like. And here's the back side. It's got a display port, VGA port, six USB ports, gigabit LAN, serial port. This is for the PS connection for the keyboard and the mouse. Here's the power supply. I actually like it, it looks pretty slick. This is for the small foam factor. So what you're gonna do is you see right here the little tab, you press on this. And look when you before you do that, you got to remove the uh, front of the cover, front cover basil. And you're just gonna lay this your finger. comes out and you can disconnect the, the power and city cable from either it's kind of, it takes a two and a half inch looks like where you can install a three and a half inch uh, hard drive but I just probably go with the solid state drive but you can go with two and a half inch uh, laptop hard drive in here so I'm just going to remove the screws You know, place on right here. We'll stab and lift this up. This will come right out. This also holds a uh, optical drive if you want to install here. Actually, I actually like the design. It's like a toolless. So what I would do is I'm gonna disconnect the uh, SATA cable from the motherboard. And the power, here's the six pin. Uh, this is internal speaker. Uh, disconnect the RAM. I'm gonna go to the back side. And remove this. Now we're gonna remove the video card. And to do that, you see right here, you're gonna press this up right here. Even before you're gonna move the video card, they're gonna lift it up like that. Cause otherwise if you didn't press on this tab, be really careful. You can damage the motherboard cause this holds down the video card. PCI Express time 16 slot. And the video card I have in here is NVIDIA NVS 510. This is for the supports up to uh, four monitors. This is for the small phone factor with low profile bracket. So what I will do is I'm gonna use a Torx T15. If you don't have a Torx T15, you can still use a flathead. It'll work perfectly fine.
And what I will do is, I'm gonna move the wire here from the power supply. This fence route that's connected. And it's got a four pin here power, CPU power. And the way you remove the power supply, it's got a, what is it, 180 watt? So you right here, you see the secure clip right here? You press this down with screwdriver, and we'll slide to the right. And you just need a flathead screwdriver. And you gotta lift up this tab right here. So now what I will do is, I'm gonna go ahead and remove the screws here. So what I'll do is I'm gonna start from the bottom, where I'm just gonna go ahead and remove the CPU cooler. Got a Intel Pentium CPU here, but you can just upgrade to either you can go to the i3 all the way the i5 to i7. Actually, I like this machine, it looks pretty slick. I like the way the design and then how easy to remove the components. And you can disconnect the, the CPU fan for the header, the motherboard. What I will do is, I need to get a napkin, wipe down the, so you have to wipe down the, CPU thermal compound paste from it before you remove the CPU because you don't want to get your hands on it in your hands. What we'll do is just throw it like this and comes out just like that. So, what I will do is this is the corner here on the left. It's got an internal speaker. That's why I have to use this mini screw, uh, Phillips head. And this is right here. And this will have to do is lift this up right here. And what I will do is I'm gonna start off from the bottom. So it's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It looks like it's got eight screws here total that you have to remove. So what I'll do is I'm gonna take the screwdriver and start removing them. So 
So if you guys were asking about the screwdrivers in our previous videos, this is a AC Delco. Uh, they are menu they actually made in 2002, I think. So this is a actually about 19 years old screwdrivers. They don't make them anymore. They're like pretty good quality. They're manufactured by AC Delco. I think they're made in Taiwan. So actually really good, really good. I like them. So now what I'll do is I'm gonna lift up this motherboard. It should come out. And what I will do will be the last part is will be removing the battery, CMOS battery. So this could be it. See you guys at the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.